from North Carolina's Cody Hoyle. We go to North Carolina's first look at Cole Huskins from Mount Holly. And he's hooked up. It's a good one. Or he's foul hooked one, I don't know. A large mouth. How about that? Barely freaking got it too, man. I don't think I need to measure him. 14, he's 15, he's 15. I'm gonna weigh him. I'm gonna weigh him. I just got a system and that's how I do it. Seen a lot of fish get caught on a jig and a drop shot this week, but we just saw Cole mix in a jerk bait. You can put him in as a pound and a half. About to slip. Pulled up to a brush pile. Suspending jerk bait over top of it. Catch a large mouth. It works. That's a good one in this tournament, bud. Cole Huskins fishing all events in Southern Opens. Journeyman on the Opens and his very, very good young talent. And then for Tommy Williams and Matsushita, two guys who won events last year to make the Classic this year, and they said, hey, I'm going all in because I'm gonna carry this momentum into the elite bid. And fifth is Daisuke Aoki, who made the Classic this year. He's gonna make next year's Classic. Skins hooked up here. Yeah. And two is just one in the live well. Oh, it's a good one. There's a very good spot of bass for Cole right here. You'll take your three pounds. However it comes, if, if it's the spotted or the largemouth variety, Tommy. Always the same. Yep, he's been bouncing around doing a couple of different things here. Not a bad one. Chunk. He's just shy. Inches and I'm measuring it. Just shy of three pounds, probably. Two, two and change. Chunky guy. Two and a quarter, two six. My kind of guy. Nice spotted bass from Lake Norman. We'll never know. We'll Dose. Never know. He's a weird, you can fan the tail. Mm, it's kind of a weird looking bass. Meanwhile, Cole's oh, got back to back fish. Yeah. This looks more like a keeper, right? Don't be close. close. This son's oh. getting right, right? Douglas not going to risk it there. Nope, that didn't quite make it. Let's see what this one does. It's not a, not a fat one by any means. That's how quick it can happen, though, on those dredge docks or those ones that have good brush or a little bit deeper. You catch one, you'll catch two or three, maybe even four, 
you can go from having zero to a limit off of one dock here, like Norman. I believe that one made the cut. So is that three or four for Cole? That is number three for that is Cole. Number three. We've had some catches. We'll catch you up on all of those, but Cole Huskins, one of the Lake Norman locals. Like oh my God, stay one. hooked up. What a set. Yeah! God, I've been waiting on that bite. Yeah, baby. Woo! I knew you could keep throwing that buzzer long enough. Whew. Dude, I seen her wake off the bank. Did you see that? Yeah, I got it. It's almost a three pounder. Great spotted bass. <whistles> Give it to us, Cole. Two, three. Good. I like it. Yes. Another good fish. Look and where I caught that fish. Oh, I think I had him in the lid. He just got his eye. It's a good one. Another solid spot of bass and for Cole. We mentioned it, Such. Middle of the Here, day. The Top water bites have been key. He's got 811 on bass track, 30 pounds, 13 ounces total. Remains in sixth place. Good little midday for Cole Huskins there. We said top water would factor. At 1 p.m., you'll start shaking when you catch number two. I'm shaking for him here. Ooh, he was looking away. Wow. I think that'll call. Right at the Still boat. Buzzing him up. Little audio difficulties. Better measure him first. Let's watch this blow up again. He's looking to the right. God, I cracked him. And that's how fast it happens. He set the hook as soon as he felt oh, yeah, it. This is definitely and it was already three foot deep. It already swam down that far that quick. Him up, didn't I? Multiple anglers lit up in green yeah. because it's starting to fire this last two hours of the day. I'm not going to say I told you so, but there's something about this week. The last two hours have been key. And look at this, another buzzbait fish. That's four or five quality keepers for Cole Huskins on top water. He's closing in on double digit fish. Wait. They fall over it. That's a good one. They fought over it. Sounds like there's multiple. Coal. Big coal here. Big coal here. Number three. Coloration varies lovely on these fish. They're my favorite, Such. 
Largemouth, smallmouth, spotted bass. I love spotted bass. Can you imagine? With a buzz bait, sad to see him put it down, but maybe a jig will work out well for him right here. Choke that jig. Dude, I just told you a second ago, I'm in that place. I heard like the uh, the Survivor theme song come on, you know. And, God. and then you catch that. Like, pull my head out. Cracked her. She was not coming off. Doing something. This bottom be a full right. 